Loco blueberries in Nova Scotia. What does it say? It's a product of Mexico. Look, I really wanted to touch a lobster. Didn't come in here. There must be some WBCCI rally going on here. That's probably the seventh or eighth airstream I've seen leaving here. Is this the second ferry? Seven dollars for this ferry. Yeah. You know it's free though, but this one only goes like a hundred yards. It's cable driven instead of motor. Yeah, it's got like you can see the rope in the water. Is that what they're doing? They're just roping us back and forth. Yeah, so it's cable driven. Oh, it's like a really bad snap right now. It's like a bridge. It's like a moving bridge on a wire. Just goes back and forth all day. Back and forth, back and forth. Campground in Cape Breton Highlands National Park. We got a site. Four days. So after five nights straight in five different Walmarts all across Nova Scotia, we are finally at a campground where we can set up, get the awning out. We got it tilted because it's raining a little bit. That way the water can drain. We also got our little storage tent set up, our chairs. Don't think it'll get very windy here, so we don't have to worry about wind too much. But we do have um, a fire pit right there, which we actually have set up under our awning. We've got this fireplace directly below the edge of the awning. We're we could probably use it if we don't put a lot of fire in it, but chances are we're not un unless we uh, put the awning back. Otherwise, I don't want to catch it on fire. But there's a fire ban right now anyways because in Nova Scotia, it's been really dry this summer so far. So the fire ban is for during the day. You can have a fire after 8 p.m. and before 10 a.m. But outside of those hours, no fires. So I think it'll be okay to not have a fire. And we don't have any firewood anyway, so we have to go buy it. But maybe if our friends Jason and Angela show up in a few days, um, yeah, see where they end up. And we can get a site and have a fire there. <laughs> 